Yo, I gotta figure this out, man. I'm not getting enough power here, and it's because this is a flat array, but the sun is not really terribly low in the sky yet. So I'm kind of procrastinating with adjusting these panels because I need to kind of figure out where the sun is gonna be. It's like this stuff, solar will never get old for me because as my system changes, every year I'm gonna have to deal with summer, winter sun, summer sun, winter sun. So I think what I wanna do, I'm tempted to take these and do these um, in a series parallel, but that doesn't make sense. I just, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm also debating whether or not I need to do a single panel approach with the Bouge RV, not the Bouge RV, the ACP, because I wanna be able to run that with my suicide cable more often than not, but this don't get power till like one o'clock. Whereas like, for whatever power this will produce while it's laying here flat or even like laying over here during the day where the sun is south facing, would it be better to just have a 300 on it that I could actually move or a 400 on it that I can actually move? And then in the mornings, what I can do is um, <laughs> I can have a panel over here to catch this early sun and then I could move it. I don't know, man. I just I, I think what the reality is, is I have too many panels. I definitely have too many of these. Well, I don't have too many, but this is why this Bouge RV panel is so nice because it's so much power in a package so similar to this. I don't know. I don't know. What should I do?